What's up guys? I'm here at the Cincinnati Zoo, so I'll take you on a walk around here and show you some of the animals. The Cincinnati Zoo is one of the oldest zoos in the country. Pretty well known zoo, and I'm excited to check it out. exhibit coming through the hole and now I'm surrounded by the meerkats. Looks like over here we have a wild dad and grandma. I'm not sure if that's meant for no. six foot two, 270 pound, 270 pound people, but we did it. You can hear the lions. I just heard the lions roaring, so I'm trying to get over there quick, see what's going on. those cave drawings have been there. The zoo is very empty today. It is a Monday and it's like 44 degrees Fahrenheit. So right now I'm on the Cincinnati Zoo train. So this will take us around the zoo and we'll be able to see some of the exhibits. So it looks like we came across some wolves. This train is moving pretty slow, but I guess that's good for seeing the exhibits. On the train, you get to pick a seat. Each seat is labeled by a different animal. I chose a penguin. I don't know why I chose penguin, but that's what I chose. What'd you choose, Dad? I wanted to choose the penguin because that looked cool, but I think I went to the rhino. The rhino? What'd you choose, Grandma? Dad chose the rhino. Grandma doesn't know what she chose. But it looks like we have some more exhibits. Looks like the flamingos. The train is picking up some serious speed now. I chose the penguin, dad chose the rhino, grandma chose the kangaroo. It looks like they have some penguins or, yeah, penguins over here. This is an African penguin. I didn't know they had penguins in Africa, but I guess they live on the tip of the Cape of Good Hope. So those red pandas were pretty cute looking. They're a lot smaller than I thought they'd be. 
I guess they eat a lot of bamboo and they live in Asia. So this reptile house is the oldest zoo building in the United States, built in 1875.